And hey there, it's me, Mud Link, and welcome to the finale of Mega Man Zero Three. So last time we took on the rest of the stage bosses, and now we're just waiting for us to analyze all the data that we collected from the library to see where Wild, could, Wild and Omega could be. So we gotta talk to Harpuya now, who's not here. Not here either, I. Right. On the other side. Whoopsie. He's in the room here. Can you stand up already? Wow, Harpoo, you're, you're hard to keep down. What are you up to? What are you up to? Why did you rescue me? Do you expect some favor in return? Perhaps. Oh, you're awake. How do you feel? Horrible. Just the thought of being helped by you makes me nauseous. Stripped of my position and driven out of New Arcadia. I'm used goods. That's not true. You just stood up for your beliefs, just like we do. You've made no mistakes. My beliefs. I can't sit back any longer. We must protect the humans from Wile. We have to stop him immediately. That... that... Wile? Wait. Your wounds are not fully healed yet. I am a warrior, born to protect humans. I am a proud warrior of Neo Arcadia. I don't need any help. If, even if my body should fall into ruin, I will still gladly fight for humanity. Right. So, Harpuya refuses to go with us. Mr. Zero, come to the commander's room immediately. You sure are running ragged, don't they, Zero? I'll be back later. Zero. Harpuya, don't you dare die. Where's watching the cops? I shouldn't open up. Uh, I accidentally skipped the light dialogue. Whoops. She's just saying, uh, we're gonna open this up. Whoops. Sorry. File. File number 94538. The Wars. Near the end of the Maverick Wars, many Cyber Elves were used. The period from this time until the end of the fighting was referred to as the Elf Wars, as a result. In particular, the use of the gigantic elf known as the Dark Elf, and copies of this elf known as Baby Elves, to amplify the power of Reploids. While, co while controlling said Reploids at will, made this the worst war in recorded history. While use of the Dark Elf brought the war to an end in four years, approximately 90% of all Reploids and 60% of all humans were wiped out. The technology used at this time, the technology using baby elves to control Reploids, this must be what Wiles is attempting to use again. I'm sure that what Zero saw the Dark Elf copy factory was machinery prepared for just this purpose. <laughs> Excellent detective work, Dr. CL. What? Unfortunately, we were a little too late. Said Dr. Wilde? <laughs> this time, Omega is absolutely perfect. I can now manipulate all the Reploids on the planet without using the baby elves and make them do whatever I want. <laughs> time to start, Omega. Now you will see, pitiful humans, what you get for banishing Dr. Wile. Taste the fear, foolish reploids who banished me. Inscribe my name upon this world, the name of your new ruler. That name is Dr. Wile. The entire world is in my hands. I have the power to crush it beneath between my fingers at any time. <laughs> no. This can't be happening. New world, a new order. 
History is once again in motion. Zero, back! Zero? Inscribe is it upon the world the name of our ruler. While, 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 while! Both of you, freeze! Ah! It's okay. They're just unconscious. All I did was disable the power of the Dark Elf. But my current power can only protect those at this base. Took you long enough, X. Where's Wile? In New Arcadia's underground power system. Sub-Arcadia. Omega is there too, transmitting the power of the Dark Elf around the world. Apparently, X and I are the only ones who can move around freely. X, tell us the coordinates for Sub-Arcadia. So you plan on fighting against Omega? Yes. Why? Nothing. I'm sure you'll be fine. Be careful, Zero. I, I verified the coordinates for Sub-Arcadia on the transfer device. Transfer me. Roger. All personnel prepare for transfer. Preparations for transfer complete. Zero. Come back safely. Mission Stato! Now we're finally at the end game here. Well, finally, it hasn't been that many, that many episodes. But still, this is a fucking great end game. Music's great, the design this place looks awesome as shit. Of course, you actually have some decent challenges coming up. And then, of course, you know, multiple stages like always. This let's play of being very short and of course the raw sanity most likely taking a long time gonna take a long time or it makes you wonder what the fuck is gonna be the next let's play. Well you have to you'll figure it out soon enough, although I don't know if I'm gonna play it that soon. I don't know. I really don't know when I'm gonna start. That's for number 16, I probably won't for a while. Just so I can work on the Ace Attorney video more. Dr. Wile. <laughs> How gallant you are, Zero, to play hero all by yourself. All the Reploids in the entire world are now under my power. Humans are like pigs, dependent upon the Reploids for their very existence. You realize, don't you, that if I felt like it, I could wipe all humans out in the blink of an eye. Kriya, Priya, do with this one as you please. I've got some pig squeals to enjoy. The squeals of indolent pigs wasting their pitiful lives on idle pursuits. Would you like to know who rules this world? <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, he's, he's, he's a fucking dickbag. Holy fuck, yeah. He's back to bad reploid. He's back to fake reploid. I'll rip you to pieces. I'll tear you to shreds. So you have to fight them again. Yeah, they aren't too different. They, they have a few different attacks. As you noticed. And they got this now. Wasn't able to avoid at all. I was too scared to do the jump over, but I mean, <laughs> you know, I should have just done that. Yeah, there's something wrong. Yes, Kriya, there's something wrong. I feel like I'm being stabbed with pins and needles. I feel like I'm being smashed with clubs and hammers. Me, me. Zero, are you alright? I just need to see some new information from X. Come back to the resistance base. Understood. Transfer me. Transfer complete. Zero, it's great to see you back safe. Extra sent us, sent us some new coordinates. Apparently they indicated where Wyo and Omega are. This may be the last battle. Come talk to me when you're ready. I thought Hirwa takes control of the world. Our terrible history will repeat again. We cannot, no, must not allow that to happen. What do you need? I want to talk to you so then. Max has been input completely. The coordinates le le lead to an abandoned research lab. According to our, re our records, this is where Wild used to carry out his research. It's right next to the place where you were sleeping, Zero. Wild and Omega are there, aren't they? Zero, be careful. I will. Operator, is everything ready? You can go at any time, Mr. Zero. Yes, I am ready. We're already at the boss room. But of course, this is the boss rush. So, first, what I'm gonna do is go here. 
I should have taken that safe assist. What's the use of sending your junk in this new world? I'll cut you down and send you off to the Deadlands. Chica, chica, chica. So yeah, obligatory boss rush like always. had it. <laughs> See, boss rush like always. Now when it comes to me, how I feel about boss rushes, I'm fine with them in the Mega Man games. It's, it's tradition at this point. But I mean, sometimes it can be a bit much. I'd say the worst boss rush has to go with like... A command mission because a boss rush in an RPG is the worst it means an RPG is gonna take fuck ton longer than than you know any of this there you go How can the newest and greatest loose old piece of junk impossible no I don't want to die I don't want to die chica chica And next one. I'm gonna go this and I'm gonna. There you go. Nice, because this is British, man. You sure are a boisterous lout? Not quietly next time, or are you manners? You have no right to live in this new world, so I'll see that you don't. Yeah, and this shit, like with like Phoenix Magnion, on, but this is still a good fight. Kiki, you silly, insub inconsiderate barbarian. Your type won't survive in the new world that's coming. Kiki, kiki. So next, I'm gonna go here. You dunderhead! Lord Wilde's ideals were set in motion a century ago. Who are you to complain now? Get with the times. Do you want to get left behind? And Ina Vita is back in... But the same as always. as fast as you want, but you'll never catch up with a history that has already passed you by. You'll be trailing behind Lord Wilde forever. Grrr. Now, of course, the only one left is the one for the Thunder Chip. And, as you can tell, it's gonna be Blazing Flizzard. Yeah! I love Lord Wild's new world, so hot! 
I won't let you get in the way. I'll turn you to ashes. I want to see if I want to cut off your tail. Oh, I got it. Yeah, hot, so hot. I'll be writhing pain alone in the new world. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I cut off his tail. He's gonna dash jump behind him. And you do it. That's it for that part of the boss rush. Only four more left, so no, you don't get to rematch the rematch the bosses that returned from the other game. They returned from Mega Man Zero One. Which is fine. Close. I, 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 this this section is a bit annoying though. There's some close guys at the end. Twenty now. It's only like twenty-one to twenty-five that gives you the health boost. There you go. Now it's time for us to deal with the second half of the boss rush. And just to deal with the pain now and have the thundership equipped. We're going to Fox Star. Fuck you. What are you doing in a place like this, little boy? It's your bedtime. You must see that world what you must you mustn't see the world that lies ahead, little boy. You mustn't survive to see it. Yeah, fuck you. Don't care. I hate you. Still hate that fight. <laughs> oh my god, I dodged it. I didn't even do it the right way. Oh, and I fuck up immediately by doing that. This one's also for this is this is an attack is a is easier to dodge. Ah, fuck off. Ah, ah, no need to throw a temper tantrum. All your struggles will be in vain. That's right. You're no hero, and you're no god of destruction either. There's nothing you can do. I mean, now to change to the flame ship. I'm gonna go in the opposite direction I went this time. So, Eggman! Eggman is back! Ha! First the thievery and now unlawful entry! How outrageous! There is no mercy for those who disrupt the order. I sentence you to death! You are forever banned from Eggman Land! Fuck you.
There we go. Easy. What is this? You dare defy my judgment? Lord Wild, strike down this foolish one. So now switch to the ice chip. And then we deal with Biblio again. Easy fight. <laughs> so you're back. So you're back. Back again. Ready to be broken. <laughs> I'll do it. I don't mind. See, can I do this without taking any damage wrong? Yep. <laughs> you broke me, but you won't be able to break Omega. I guarantee that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this fight's always really fucking easy. Is that it? That one time, because I was in a room that had fucking spikes on the ceiling. That was actually that was pretty funny, though, at least. Now, of course, Protista Calvarian. I am the guard dog of Hades. Lord Wilde instructed me not to let you in. I'll bite you to chunks. Come and get it. <laughs> See, it is supposed to be based off the surface, also because he summons two other dogs. Instead of having three heads, he just summons two dogs. And if you say, on the outside, Cupid Fox Torch is being bullshit with that one attack, Calvarian is probably the hardest of them. Mantis is also hard too. It's, it's funny, the ones that don't have a fucking weakness are the hardest are the hardest of the fights. Having yourself in the corner is actually really damn good for this. How, how did this happen? Why can't I bite you to chunks? Why do I hurt all over again? Ouch, ouch, ouch! There we go. All of the fights. All the boss rush fights are now done, which means all we got left is this tiny section and one last fight. And just for good measure, spikes. Because the game's just like, hey, you know what? Fuck it. Spikes. Mm -hmm. 
Hehehehe. <laughs> Having fun playing the hero, Zero. Hmm. You do understand, don't you, that I have no time for your petty games? So let's finish this once and for all, shall we? Hehehehe. <laughs> How pitiful. Of course, a Reploid like you would never understand. The joy of ruling all that you see. Only a human can under possibly understand. A human? That's right! I'm a bona fide human! The creator of Reploids. A human being! The desire for power. The joy of making everything work for you. You have no way of experiencing this without a human brain. It's the ultimate joy. No mere Reploid could ever understand. I bet most decent humans wouldn't understand either. You look like just another maverick to me. All I gotta do is dispose of you like any other maverick. <laughs> good, good. An excellent speech, Zero. You must feel great, right? Oh, Zero. You were a fun guy, Zero. I'd like to play some more, but it's time we parted. I have some more fun surprises left in store for you. Enjoy them to last, Zero. Here we go. The final battle. Against Omega, and I got hit because I'm an idiot. Fuck. He's... Yeah, I'm forgetting fucked again like the last time. Why? Sinuate is Omega. There are three phases. So, be prepared. Also, you have to restart if you lose against any of them. So, yeah. Fuck. I don't know why. Just use the fucking... The buster. The buster. All you need to use. So you don't get healed in between any of the phases. So. Fuck! Tried sliding. <laughs> I'm stuck at this. So yeah, just use the buster. It's not, it's not all I'm gonna do right now. Just use the buster for the first phase. I'm not expecting to do the normal pattern. Fuck, okay, yeah, I just. Fuck, yeah. She said the breathe right there. Oh, fuck, why am I acting like an idiot for doing these fights? Just pay attention, that's all you need to do for this. First phase is now done. Hehehe, <laughs> not bad, Zero. But Omega's true power is much greater than you've been led to expect. Go get him, Omega. Release the power of the Dark Elf. <laughs> wish I had. Wish I got the sub tanks. It's fun. 
So here's the second phase. Gotta hit his head right there. Shit. Fuck, I keep on getting hit. Yeah, so I'm definitely gonna lose this one. This one here. So you just mash quickly to get out of there. Fuck. So hang on. Okay, I'm back. I actually took zero damage in that in that first phase. Cause I'm not a dumbass. I gotta stop being a dumbass. So that's gonna follow you. So you just gotta. Now I just gotta time to jump right. There's the big fuck you cannon. Fuck! <laughs> Damn it, I was doing so well! So yeah, that's the best way to do it. I just fell off there like an idiot. Hang on. Yeah, this time I got hit twice like an idiot. But I should be able to do this. Fuck! Try jumping from that. Fuck. Timed it wrong. So I'm just gonna get fucked again. Okay, I'm back. Zero hits. Fuck. I messed up the goddamn time a little bit. Fucking shit. Dash jump over it. Fucking Christ. Okay. So I definitely say this this part this part of the fight's the hardest. Fuck. Yeah, this is definitely my favorite boss fight in the entire Mega Man series though. Fuck, I need the fucking slide jump. Dash jump over it. Oh my god, I'm being such a shithead. Alright, back again. So yeah, this is definitely my favorite boss fight in the entire Mega Man, Mega Man series. Hard as shit. Fuck, should've just stayed still. Fuck. There you go. I missed. Damn it. I keep on getting my top fucking hit. Fuck. Alright, I'm back again. So yeah. Easily the best boss fight in the entire series. I love the song that plays here. Fuck. Love the song that plays here. Fucking getting hit there. Say, so just use a buzzer shot here. Fuck. So yeah, the second phase and the third phase are my favorite parts of this fight. This song is amazing, but the final phase is the best one. Uh, easily. Fuck. Really? Oh my god. Fucking Christ. I'm playing 
looking like dog shit today. Alright, trying this again, just stop being stupid. Like that. There you go. Stop being a dumbass. Just do it. Okay. I just was an idiot again. Okay, now stop being a fucking idiot. Just do this. Still wasn't an idiot anyway. Try doing the fucking dash jump. Fuck, I missed. You know what? I'm swallowing pride right now. Setting on There we go. Just had to use it once, it's fine. And here we go, the best part of it. The best part of this fucking game. The best part of the Mega Man series. Well I mean the X and Zero fight comes pretty close. But this What is this place? This is where I was sleeping. <laughs> Excellent, Zero. Your power is extraordinary for a mere fake. Fake? <laughs> you, the legendary Reploid? You fool! Those resistance losers just decided to call the Reploid they found here Zero for some reason. You might be Zero in a way, but you are still merely a copy. You're no legendary hero at all. You're just a reproduction. <laughs> you thought you were a hero all along, didn't you? Never suspecting that you were a mere copy? What a joke! Omega himself is the one and only original Zero. You're just a copy of him. The original Zero? Why is he your slave then? <laughs> He's a bloodthirsty god of destruction. All I did was upgrade him to draw out all of his power. That's all right. Omega, should I say original Zero? Time to wake this pitiful fake from a century long dream. Now it's time for the best song of the fucking game. <laughs> Fuck. So yeah, that was Cannonball. We'll hear more of it after, hang on. Hut! 
Bessianari! <laughs> Yes, the song is this fucking good. The song, this fight's one of the best in the series. You're fighting your fucking self. Fucking Christ! <laughs> so yeah, we're back here. So we're, we're where we found Zero in the. Yeah, we got these fucking song cannonballs, and one of the best fucking songs in the series. And it's probably the hardest part of, of this of this fight is this. This is pretty damn difficult. It's fast paced as shit. Fucking Christ, I'm an idiot. Hang on. <laughs> I love hearing that every time, even if it's been annoying, kind of annoying that I've died so many times. Okay. See, it's very fast paced. If I can go badly. At any point, it's really hard to not use hyper, not use fucking elves in this, unless you have, of course, you have every single, like you have all the fucking health upgrade ones. Yeah. Like, well, I wish the game didn't front load you with like, oh, you're a fake for this entire fucking. This entire fucking game, because it did get kind of like you know. A bit too much, like, oh, you're not real, you're not, you're a fake, blah 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 blah. Still doesn't make this boss fight any more fucking awesome. Anyway, I am fucking up rank a lot, but I don't care. Nearly out of fucking cyber elves. Oh my god. <laughs> Not gonna finish off with the saber slash. And there we go. Best boss fight finished. That was a lot of tries. <laughs> And my rank went down only to B. You plan to reactivate Omega? Hehehe, he, he, watch, but don't interfere. Don't forget, I hold the lives of all humans and reploids in my hand. Urk. Zero, what are you doing? Hurry, stand up! Hey, I'm here to get a little payback, Omega. Yeah, remember when we existed? 
time to straighten the it's time to straighten the record. You guys, Wild is trying to bluff you. He can't do anything in his current state. Ah, Dark Elf, shut them up. Zero. What is the Dark Elf? Her, her Dark Elf's curse is fading. Who's that? X? That's right, Wild. Just like a century ago, I worked with Zero to defeat this Omega. Then, and we saved the world from your greedy clutches. Just like a century ago. Defeated Omegas using your original body. That's all. Your current body may be a copy, but your heart is the real thing. Alright, now's the time. While well, the Dark Elf's power is weak, time to finish what you started a century ago, Zero. Zero, don't do it! That's your original body! Don't you feel any attachment? Are you really prepared to spend the rest of your life in that cheap fake? You can do it. You know it's truly important. Go on, Zero. 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 Wake up, Zero. Can you hear me, Zero? My energy is almost spent. I can't stay in this world much longer. Zero, I want to leave this world in your care. The threat Wild represents has not left this world. I want you to protect humans and reploids. Zero, you can do it. You can. Zero, wake up! Zero! Oh, what a relief. I was so worried about you. Mr. Zero, you regained consciousness. What a relief. Hey, everyone! Mr. Zero's awake! He's alright! Yahoo! Where is this? The resistance base? How could have. Who could have. Zero. Dark Elf? Wait, no. You're... You're... She brought you back here. She brought you back here. Zero. What a warm, gentle light. Mother Elf. Has Wild's curse been broken? Shouldn't we follow her? She's finally free. There's still Wild, but let's let her get in... Let's let her go in peace for now. X told me about you, Zero. Really? I know you're not worried about a thing, but... Even if your body is a copy, as long as your heart is, in your, is your own, you are Zero. The one and only Zero. Zero, thank you. It's a Zero! It's just me. I am Zero. And there we go. Mega Man 03 has been beaten. Sure, some difficulty on that last boss. <laughs> Mainly for the second form. The second form is really fucking hard. The third form is also really hard too. It's also why it's my favorite boss fight in the entire game. Not because of the story, but just because of how fucking fast paced and hard it is. So, anyway, yeah. Now you can see why this is my favorite. Sure, I do think they may be a bit heavy-handed with you being like, oh, you're actually a fake, blah, blah, blah. So the twist isn't as big of a reveal. But it's still fucking amazing twist. And it's just how thematic it is. You're fighting on where, where you were resurrected, where, where you were found by CL, fighting your original body, meant for its original purpose. Remember, Wily created Zero so that... You can fucking so you can like destroy the world basically, and he has the power to do it. Uh, Mega Man X5 also goes into this a lot more. Which hey, maybe I'll play the X games one day. Who knows? Maybe I'll play the X games on here. Oh, that would require the other one. Oh, that would require certain ones that I really don't want to play again. But if it's for you guys, I'll probably do it. Maybe that'll be what I do for the next Let's Play for every fifth one. But no, I don't think so. There's still Mega Man 04 to do, which. I definitely think is worse than this game and only slightly better than the second one, but we'll get into Mega Man X, uh, Mega Man 04 when we get into it. Anyway, yeah, this is my favorite 
Mega Man Zero game. It's my favorite Mega Man game in general. The stages are fucking great. I love the boss fights. Minus Cupid Foxstar. That Omega fight is really cements this as well. Wile is the is a good is a great villain for this. He's an absolute he's an absolute fucking scumbag. It's kind of kind of sucks he kind of gets away with it at the end of this game, but you know, hey, that's what the next game's for. The other thing though, the the Guardians really should have played more of a role. Like, sure, Harpuya is much better than he was in the other game. So that's for sure. I do I did like Harpuya in this game. But the other two, they fight Omega once, they fuck off for the rest of the game until that last moment. It's kind of stupid, not gonna lie. But it's better what happens within the next game. Um, but yeah, so anyway, that's gonna be for this. So for my next Let's Play, it's gonna go to a franchise that I've, gonna go back to a franchise that I've played before on this channel. And, hey, it's another follow-up, so you're just going to have to see what it is, although you most likely can guess, but that's not going to be for a while, because I want to work on the Ace Attorney video more, and I want to finish it. Hard mode added. It was minigame. So yeah, there we are. Let's just uh, change the wallpaper here. I don't like that one. This one. There you go. Because, of course, whenever we get around to play Mega Man Zero 4, I'm going to use this background. So, anyway, that's it for this episode. So, well, that's it for this series. So, I'll be seeing you guys in the next Let's Play. And, of course, with continuing Pokemon Radical Red. So, take care.